What's good YouTube? It's your boy Jay Will coming at y'all with another video, you know what I'm saying? AJK. In today's video, man, I'm about to give y'all five ways to get out of a funk. All right, and when I say funk, bro, it's on the lines of depression, bro. It's basically a form of depression. You don't feel like doing anything and you feel like you're stuck. Before I start today's video, man, make sure you leave a like, comment down below what else you wanna see next on the channel. And also, if you're new to the channel, bro, hit that subscribe button. Without further ado, man, let's hop straight into the video. Oh, shit. Before I hop into the list, of ways to get out of a funk bro let me go ahead and just say this real quick i'm not a doctor bro i'm not a guru i'm not none of that these are things that i've done to get out of the funk and get back on track to achieve my goals and reach for things that i always wanted to do and be you know what i'm saying so i got five tips on how to get out of a funk i'm gonna just say each tip and then just explain exactly why these are important okay so for the first one, eat better food and stop eating processed food. When I say processed food, that is junk food, that's chips, pastries, donuts, all that whole category, bro. Don't even touch that, especially fast food. It's fast food for a reason. That food has no nutrients. That food is going straight through you. Why you think when you eat McDonald's or Taco Bell, you got a shit in like 30 minutes? Don't eat that food, all right? You need to substitute that food for healthier food, like a salad, spinach, fruit, everything that's high vibrational food, that needs to be your diet. I know y'all know the saying, you are what you eat. So if you putting a large fry, large Coke, and a big ass burger with hella bacon and other type of shit on there, bro, that's what you are. You a burger, a fry, and a drink. Bro, you don't need that. Everything is a choice, bro. You have a choice to choose whether you're gonna eat better and live a better life, or you're gonna choose to eat bad and have a bad life. Number two, we got on the list, which is pretty simple. I said this in my previous videos, you need to get sleep. Sleep is one of those things that is a all around benefit. It helps with your hair, it helps with your skin, it also helps with your mood. You can't tell me when you be sleep and somebody wake you up before you even supposed to wake up, you get mad as hell. If you get six to eight hours of sleep every single day, I'm telling you, you're gonna get out of the funk way much faster than people that don't realize this. And they always wonder like, damn, why am I waking up so angry? Why am I waking up so mad? Why am I having a bad day? You have to look back at yourself. Everything is self-reflection. Like I said, you gotta look back at what you've been eating and also how you've been sleeping, bro. If you sleeping horrible and you eating horrible, best believe you are gonna get into a rut or a depressive run, man. We don't wanna go through that. I'm telling you, the ways to avoid it, eat better and get six to eight hours of sleep, all right? Number three we got on the list, man. You need to exercise at least three to four times a week. Now I know, I know when it comes to exercising, it may be hard for some people, but you don't gotta go full blast into a whole ass workout that's gonna damn near kill you in that first day because that's gonna ruin your motivation and your drive. What you wanna do is start off slow. That first day, you know, do some light reps. That second day, do more reps. Third day, do more reps. Each day you progress and you're getting better each day. When you exercise almost every single day, it's like these chemicals, I wanna say they're called endorphins or whatever they're called. They're getting released into your brain to make you feel good about yourself. The more you're working out, you're getting more pump. You pump your iron, you're getting more muscles. That's gonna make you feel good about yourself too. Cause when you look in the mirror, you be like, damn, who is that? That's you. You did that. You went to the gym, you took care of yourself. So now you're gonna feel better about yourself. Number four on the list, man. Get off your phone slash social media and all of that shit, all right? We all have 24 hours in a day. You shouldn't take two hours, three hours on your phone checking social media checking to see who posted this and who posted that you need to be on your purpose bro you need to actually go for your goals try to achieve your goals man this is a bad habit back then they didn't have phones bro this right here can destroy your social skills you gonna stop making friends because you so used to texting on your phone so much you don't even know how to interact with people in real life bro 
life. And that's crazy. You don't know how to interact with people and make friends. You don't know how to say, hey, how you doing? How's your day? Oh, my name is John. What's your name? Like, you don't know what to say to people because you're so caught up in your damn phone looking at booty and looking at whatever it is, bro. Stay off your phone, all right? All right, y'all, number five on the list. This is the last tip for this video. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up. I told you I'm not making this video too long, all right? Just because this tip is the last one doesn't mean it's not important, but that last tip is to meditate, all right? When you meditate, you're clearing your mind and you're actually relaxing your body. When you take those deep breaths, it's like a charge that is telling your body like, hey, hey, we got this, relax. If you keep doing that almost every single day, you're gonna feel better. Especially if you incorporated those other four tips, you're gonna feel way better about yourself. All five of these tips will help you in general, but meditating is on a whole nother level. People think you have to sit there, everything has to be quiet, you gotta put your hands up like these and close your eyes, cross your legs, bro. No, it's nothing like that at all. All you gotta do is just relax. When you meditate, you should be focusing on the present. You shouldn't be thinking about the future and you shouldn't be thinking about the past. You need to focus on right now, bro, because right now matters. You may not make it till tomorrow. You might die tonight and I ain't even being negative. That's just facts, bro. Life is like a vapor, bro. We here one minute and we can be gone the next minute. Take the time out each day, man. Follow these tips and just meditate, bro. Breathe, take the time out. Self-care, self-love, man. I love y'all, man. I hope you doing better for yourself. I know it's been a minute since I've been posting on this channel, man. I had to get right myself, all right? But yeah, man, like I said, I ain't gonna make this video too long. Man, make sure you like this video. Comment down below what else you want to see next on the channel. And also, if you're new to the channel, man, hit that subscribe button. It's your boy Jay Will signing out, man. Peace.